How are things doing guys? I hope everything is good. In this video, we will look at 9 valuable activities you can do when you're bored and have nothing else to do. We can all agree that we waste time, which is one of our most valuable resources. We frequently waste it on some of the most pointless items you can think of. You might make some extremely awful decisions while you're bored because it's been stated that an idle mind is the devil's workshop. Why? Because you now need to find the dopamine by acting on impulses that make you feel good at the time rather than by being productive in some way. Therefore, you must find something useful to do when you are bored. You'll feel better, I assure you, than idly contemplating whether to order Chinese or pizza for dinner while gazing up at the ceiling. To ensure you never miss an upload from us, give this video a big thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and ensure alerts are turned on. Thanks for visiting the Wisdom Mentor channel. If you're new around here, we publish material that makes money and in-demand talents. Let's watch the video now without further ado. I'll offer you a list of 9 activities in this video that you should do the next time you find yourself bored and want to kill some time. Oh, and here's a fascinating fact. Michael Fortino, a time management expert estimates that throughout a lifetime, you will spend 120 days brushing your teeth, 7 years eating, 5 years standing in line, 3 years attending meetings, 1 year looking for things, 8 months opening junk mail, and 7 years cleaning your house. Although I'm not certain if this information is relevant, it's still useful to know. Here are 9 activities you may do in your spare time if you want to enhance productivity and feel a lot better at the end of the day, which I think we all do. Number 1. Make your own business In the modern day, it's never been simpler to launch a business or side hustle and begin earning a living from it. There are hundreds of various of ways to make money online and support your lifestyle as a result of how fundamentally the internet has altered how people and businesses operate. You can establish a YouTube channel, produce a book, create an Instagram page, use Shopify, or do what I did and start a blog. There are dozens of different methods to generate money online. All it takes is a little study a commitment to starting anything and persistence. Number 2. Read a book. Reading books is a terrific method to get inspired and motivated. Broaden your knowledge and boost your income. Successful people never stop learning. You can enter a completely different universe through books. Some books transport you to the stars where you encounter characters like Han Solo, while others transport you to Westeros, home of the Seven Kingdoms, with the strangest inhabitants. In some books, you'll learn how to acquire a new ability. In others, you'll learn about our past. And in still others, you'll learn something novel and fascinating about our planet. One of the best ways to learn more is to read books. Additionally, it makes you more intriguing to chat with. Number 3. Clean your room. Just look about your home or bedroom for a moment, and then tell me what you observe. Believe me, I know that doing chores might be one of the most boring things you can do. But coming home after a long day of work to a tidy, clean house is worthwhile. Turn on some enjoyable music, something you can sing or dance to, that will warm your blood 
and make the activity more appealing. Then start the washing machine while turning up the volume. Before you know it, you'll have completed your chores and likely feel quite worn out but also a lot happier. Number 4. Exercise If you guys aren't exercising already, I suggest you start dusting off those old sneakers and get yourself moving. I think exercising is a no-brainer. The benefits are just astounding. Just a few advantages of exercising include looking better, losing weight, getting slim, building muscle if desired, and generally becoming fit as a fiddle. And these are simply the physical advantages of exercise. Others include better sleep, better memory, reduced depression, and so many other advantages. Exercise releases endorphins, which make you feel a lot better and happier. Number 5. Meditation Meditating is one of the most effective activities you can do when you have free time. And I know many of you are probably thinking this, but one of the most significant and beneficial habits you can develop is meditation. Numerous studies have shown that even 5 minutes a day of meditation can have a significant positive impact. I know it can seem like one of the most mundane and boring activities in the world, especially when you're bored, but the advantages are worthwhile. Number 6. Take a class. Why not try learning something new, such as a new language, cooking technique, online course, or anything else? There are countless new talents you can add to your repertoire. And best of all, most of them can be acquired for free. For instance, viewing movies on YouTube taught me how to animate. And I'll be enrolling in a personal finance school in a few weeks. So I'll have some awesome new material for you guys. Number 7. Develop a hobby or a skill. If you're bored and have nothing to do, you should consider learning a new skill or picking up a new pastime. Among other things, hobbies include cycling, making new friends, and traveling. They can help you step outside of your comfort zone and take on new challenges. For instance, bungee jumping is a very insane pastime that can inspire you to finally launch the business you've been mulling over. You can also accomplish any kind of productive things. Number 8. Mark your calendars. Perhaps you have a few weddings and birthdays that you ought to put up on your calendar. Finally, but certainly not least, please delete your web history. I mean my gosh, some of the things you guys browse online. Guys, I'm joking. I know that the people in the Practical Wisdom community are good. I certainly hope so. Finally, if you don't already have a job, consider trying to find one. Number 9. Set the record straight. I am sure that each of us has certain objectives that we would like to accomplish. Whether you have written them down on a piece of paper or have kept them in your mental file cabinet. Since you're bored and purportedly have nothing better to do, what should you do? Why not start by assessing your objectives? It's better to create goals while you're bored if you don't already have any, or if you haven't precisely defined them. Setting an objective provides you with a sense of direction and the level of attention necessary to attain them. I appreciate you all for watching. I sincerely hope you liked seeing this. I'd love to hear your opinions, so please share them in the comment area below. You might also want to share any other unique methods 
You guys like to pass the time. I want to say thank you very much. And promise to meet everyone at the following video. From the Wisdom Mentor channel, we'll see you in the next video.